Hey guys, it's Kyle. Welcome back to a brand new video, guys. Today, I'm going to be doing a little bit different of a video. I know typically you see me chopping around and hopping and scopping around in the Minecraft game, but today, we are going to be learning together. Well, I already know. So I'm going to be teaching you how to download the worst client, guys. Not like the worst client as in it's a terrible client, but the worst client as in like like worst. <laughs> like worst for Minecraft. Guys, if you don't know what this is, this is... Basically, this is just a bunch of hacks all thrown into one version of Minecraft that you can bring in and you can turn them on and off inside of Minecraft. Now, if you did miss the video I uploaded yesterday, it was a hacked factions and we did use this client. So I figured I'd do a video to let you guys know how to install this client and see if you guys want to use it. So, what you're going to want to do guys is first you're going to want to come to this link right here. This is going to take you to the 1.10 version which is probably the best version to play in based on servers now because all of them are kind of in transition so they kind of keep it in between the 1.10 and the 1.11 phase so I think 1.10 is the most stable as well as it's the best one for servers it's the one that I use so I will leave this link down below it will take you directly to this page and then all you have to do is you have to scroll down to where it says downloads now don't even worry about the source code zip or the zip code or the source code tar.gz don't worry about any of those things all you want to click is download worst. That's it. It's going to take you to an ad fly. Do not, I believe it's going to take you to an ad fly. It should take you to an ad fly. Yeah. Oh, it takes you to worst. Yeah, it takes you to ad fly, guys. Basically, do not click ever, ever. Do not ever click anything down here. All you want to do is click skip ad. You're going to have to wait five seconds and it'll download. It's going to download down here. It's fairly a fairly small download, so it shouldn't take. Yeah, we're good. Alright all right, guys, so once it is downloaded, this is what it will look like, it'll just, it'll be, if you do, I do suggest having WinRAR to open this file, if you do not, I will link that down below in the description as well, but basically, this is what you want, you just want this folder right here, and then basically, you're going to go into your .minecraft folder, which you should be able to see a portion of that, so you're going to go into your .minecraft folder, and you're going to scroll down, not to mods, I know that's usually where we go, no, and you're going to scroll down to versions. Now, these are all of the versions that you have in your Minecraft right now. So I have 1.6.4, Forge. All of these versions are versions that I have played inside of the game. Then basically what you're going to want to do is you're going to open up this file. Now, if you do have this, if you have WinRAR, it's not going to like that I have it for free. That I haven't paid for it. So basically I'm going to X all that out. Could you not? So this is what it's going to look like. It's going to be like this inside of your WinRAR folder. Now basically you're going to want to ignore this, you're going to want to ignore this, and you're going to want to ignore this. The only thing that you want out of this folder is this right here. This folder right here. And you're just simply going to take this folder and drag it into your versions. So it's going to put it into my Minecraft versions. That's it. It's that simple. And to prove that it works, I will run Minecraft. Because if you doubt my words, you know, you, you can look. All right, so what you're going to want to do is I have it set up for worst right here. But if I wanted to make a new profile, I could just call it. I'm going to actually spell it right this time, you know, because that, that would be good. I'll just call it worst, right? Bam. And all I'm going to want to do is I'm going to want to scroll all the way up to the top, and it's going to appear right here. And that's it. It's that simple. You're going to hit save profile. You're going to scroll down to your worst the one that you just set up hit play game will open it will load your worst client in because because you've never downloaded it before it will have to it will take a second to load but it's that simple guys it will now boot up my minecraft it'll give you this if you see this you know you did it right if you see the fact that it says worst with a bunch of tnt you know you did it right guys basically once it loads up you will have i'll show you the main menu it looks pretty sweet Got a whole lot of stuff to mess with. There's so many different keybinds. It's insane. I don't know why you're taking so long, Minecraft. You don't like that I'm playing with Worst? All right, guys. So this is what the screen looks like when you get to the main screen. You have Worst and it's all its glory. Up top, it will basically it will say that Worst is updating. It will, as you can see right here, it says mine is Worst Client 4.0 outdated. All rights reserved to the young man named Alexander 01 1998. Basically, it will install the update and all. 
But as you can see right here, you have alt manager, single player, multiplayer, and basically once you happen to your single player world, you will be able to mess with all your keybinds. It's basically it's right there in your settings, guys. So that's how you do it. That is how you install the worst client, guys. I hope you do use this because it is truly a very fun thing to use. It just makes Minecraft an entirely different experience. So guys, if you did enjoy this video, let me know, like rating down below. Make sure you subscribe so you don't miss any content that is coming up, guys. Thank <laughs> you.